Okay, so I did that tutorial recently for like my red carpet lip or whatever and a lot of you guys wanted to see something that would be a little bit more natural because that ended up looking a little bit like gothy <laughs> like a little cool toned a little darker um just one thing that I want people to keep in mind unfortunately studio lighting just does not look the same so I actually posted a photo of that lip on Instagram in direct sunlight just so that you could see how different it looks because it looked so different because a lot of people were like whoa no. Regardless, I'm going to show you the same kind of idea, but for a much more natural look. Uh, and I'm going to basically use the same products. In my first tutorial, I started off with Makeup Forever, what was it called? Endless Cacao uh, 506 Lip Pencil, which is like kind of dark, cool toned. And then I went in and I think it, did I use this one? LC Cosmetics Blush Lip Liner. So I'm actually going to do the reverse. So I'm going to start off by lining my lips and uh, overlining and structuring them with this one first. A freshly sharpened lip pencil is definitely um, a must for this kind of thing. So I explained in the other video that I like to overline my lips and yeah, I don't know what to say. I like to even them out, whatever. Lip liner basically is just going to help you kind of like shape your lips. It gives you more precision and it prevents your lipstick from running. Oh, I filmed another video. So my bottom lip might be looking sparkly. So I'm gonna start off with my cupid so. Okay, now something that's really nice about this lip liner is the fact that it's a little bit darker than my lip color, but it's pretty much the same color idea, you know? It's kind of just like ever so slightly darker. So it's a very flattering color. So now what I'm gonna do is using that lip, that same lip liner, I'm gonna do my contouring with this product. So just kind of a light blend there. My boyfriend is literally on a work call right now and he has like a deep voice. So those of you with headphones on might be able to hear him and I'm not stopping. Uh, I'm gonna do it on the outer part of the lower lip as well. So this kind of like turning my lip liner using the flatter side to just kind of blend and create a little bit of definition. And then I showed this kind of like keyhole, like kissy lip thing in the other one. You can do that with this one. I'm using a slightly lighter lip liner than I did in that one. Um, so basically the idea of it is just kind of like creating like that kind of <laughs> look. So kind of just deepening up the inner part of my lip and also here. Which just kind of gives it that like you know, Angelina Jolie thing. Now, before I go in with any kind of lipstick, uh, I'm going to go in with Makeup Forever and Less Cacao. But what I'm gonna do with this instead is focus it in the areas where I overlined the most. And basically what I'm gonna do is just like kind of outline, but I'm gonna use a nice light hand. So right here, right on the outer corner, on the bottom part of my lip. And then the bottom outer corner. Now I'm gonna go in with a, a light liquid lipstick. And I can't remember what I used. Did I use About Face? No, I think I used Ofra. Let's use something lighter. So I think I used Sao Paulo before. I'm gonna use Nude Potion. Wait, did I use Nude Potion? I can't remember, I'm gonna use Nude Potion. Same deal. All right, and then once again, finishing off with Makeup by Mario, I believe I use this, right? Golden Nude, that's what I'm gonna use. Okay, right, so that's it. It is literally the exact same products, just changing up the order in which you use them. 
and how much of each one makes a huge difference. It looks a lot more um, light and natural. Uh, and I can actually show you an even more natural version of this. So if you want to see that, let me know. I am also happy to do a version, because um, I got a lot of questions, a version using like very different colors. People were asking, can you use this with red? Can you use this with like any lip color? And you absolutely can. Um, so yeah, let me know. I think I like this one better. Looks a little less um, goth. Let me know your thoughts. Okay, bye.